In this video, we're going to take a look at how to manage your notification alerts so that you can be made aware of any changes that are made within the Enterprise Portal. The first place we're going to do that is on our My Site. So we're logged in as ourselves on our My Site page. We're going to click on the My Profile tab. Beneath your photo on that page, click on Edit My Profile, and that brings you to the input screen where you can add or delete various types of information that people will see on your My Site. If you scroll down about midway, one of the areas is called Newsfeed Settings. Second below that is Email Notifications. Here is where you can click to indicate how often or when you would like to see information sent on to you. So for example, if you would like to be notified by email every time someone leaves a little note on your profile, you can go ahead and click that box. If you'd like to know when someone adds you as a colleague to a group, you can click that box as well. And if you would like them to send you suggestions for new colleagues by looking at your keyword tags, you can select that box as well. I'm going to leave that one unchecked for now. And then at the very bottom of the page, if you scroll down, you just click Save and Close, and then it's going to save those general alerts um, to your profile settings. The other place that you can set alerts is on the staff intranet. So I've navigated over to our staff intranet, and I've gone to our Groups and Committees tab, and right now I am in the Power Users group. In order to set a notification here, it's a little bit different than the way you did in the My Site. So we're going to scroll down until we click on the discussion board. So for example, if I wanted to be alerted every time someone made a change or added something to our discussion board that we're keeping together here, I would go here to the discussion board. And then at the top, you'll notice that there's a pop-up that says List Tools. If you click on Items, it brings up some new information in your ribbon, and one of them is Alert Me. If you click on the little arrow right below that, the bottom option is Manage My Alerts. So you can click there. And it's going to bring you to a screen where if you've already set up some alerts, they will be listed here. But at the very top, you're going to click on Add Alert. Now it brings you to a page where you have several options here. You can add alerts to anything, documents, images, forms. So if someone added any of those things and that was something that you're interested in being alerted on, you can go ahead and click those. But we're going to scroll down until we find the tab that says Discussion. There it is, our Team Discussion. So I would like to be notified every time something's added to our Team Discussion. So I'm going to click the radio button and then click Next. And it brings up a screen to ask you for a little bit of um, additional information. So in this area, it just says Team Discussion. I'm going to make that a little more specific so that I know that it's the Power Users Team. And here, I'm going. if your name is not here, you can go ahead and type your name in here so that it knows that you are going to be sending the alerts to that specific person. Now here you can set that your alerts are sent to your email, which is what I've selected, but you could also select your text message area here. So if you would like to have um, your alerts sent to your phone, you can, you can do that as well. You can select what type of changes you would like to be alerted on. So I have it se selected to all changes, but you could just add it to new items, or if items are modified, or if items are deleted. That's your preference. And then here as well, it also asks you to be a little bit more specific about when you would like alerts sent. So you have some uh, control over what alerts are sent to you. And then the very last option gives you some choice about how often you would like these alerts. If you leave it in the top radio button, every time someone makes a change on the discussion board, it's going to send me an email. That might be a little bit messy in my email box. So I like to select the Send Me a Daily Summary. And it even allows you here to select what time you would like that to come to you. So I'm going to select uh, 9 a.m. so that in the morning I can see what the changes are. And once I'm happy with all of my selections, I just simply click OK. And then you'll notice that here, our daily frequency alerts are listed here. And the one I just added was the team discussion to the power users. So I'm all set with my alerts. The next piece that we're going to look at is that you should get a little message in your um, first class email box that lets you know that those alerts have been sent. So let's take a peek and see if it's appeared yet. So I'm opening up my mailbox. And there it is. So SharePoint has sent me a message to say that the Team Discussion Power Users has been successfully added and that I will receive alerts. And that's as simple as it is to send an alert to your email.